Welcome back, guys, to, uh, what is it? Episode 3 of Deadly Flare. It's good to be back. As you can see, we're back at the bunker because it seems like the game has had an update that screwed up my save files, and I'm super sorry about that. But the good thing about this, we didn't make it too far, so hopefully we're going to be able to make progress and do better things. Oh, the things that were screwed up before, we can make them better. So I'm excited, I'm excited. So what we're going to do, we're going to collect everything in this bunker. Yoink, 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 yoink. And we're ready to head out. Actually, before we head out, I want to let you guys know, as I hit 20k subs, I have now released a 20k sub club merch, which is a limited time merch that you can get your hands on right now. Just follow the link down below. And once again, guys, I can't thank you enough for all the support you've given me the last couple of months. All right, now I'm ready. Let's get out. So what we're going to do here, we're going to loot real quick. I'm going to loot everything here. I'm going to do the tutorial stage. Hey, bud, how's it going? We're going to get the car running and then we're going to go over and start building our base. So I'll see you guys when the car is ready to go. So, engine, tire, tire, battery, and a gas can. As you can see, we found a lot of gas. We found some uh, spare tires. I think there's another one back there. And then uh, we're fully stacked in here. Found two guns. That's some really neat stuff. So, the next step will be to get the car running. I think we should be able to do that if we just repair it. Is that it? But it looks like it's stuck in the ground, doesn't it? All right, let's get in. All right, everything good. Wait, what's that? Okay, so this got to be some new stuff. I don't know if we can get rid of all these this text. Look at that, gas station military. To be honest, I'm going to see if there's any way I can get rid of this. So if I do seven, that's when I see all of that. Mm, so it's a, like it reads the compass when I'm in the car. I don't know if I like this. Because that takes away a lot of exploration. I think this has something to do with the update. We might just have to live with it. Let's go get in. Uh, I'm going to check these cars as well. I know a lot of you guys have been telling me, it's like, go here and go there. You will find the weapon. But the thing is, the loot is randomized. So if you guys found an MP5 in here, I find a toolbox, you know? I think we're going to check these houses out. Because that's something that we actually missed the last time. We're going to check every police car as well. It feels like we should be able to find some loot in those. I mean, we already found two uh, guns, right? Or guns, pistols. It would be nice to have something more, a little bit more automatic, you know? Look at this. This is beautiful. Hunter's cabin. What's that? Electric cable. We already found some stuff that we uh, didn't find before. All right, let's take the car down there and we're going to check the police car and we're going to go and check on the log cabin. I mean, at the other hand, it would make sense that we would not know the area, right? Because we lived here. We were in our bunker, so we should know this town by by fault. Is that, do I use that right? I don't know, but it, it feels like we should. All right, let's, uh, let's get over to the log cabin. Whoop. Damn, was that a bird? Okay, here we go, here we go. So I'm pretty double-sided. Oh, <laughs> with the whole uh, that we know where everything is. But as I said before, it does make sense because we are from this area. So we should know what's around. All right, let's see. All right, there we go. We got three foundations up and running. We got ourselves a campfire, a sleeping bag, and <sighs> a box. So I unloaded ourselves. So all the loot is in there. So we're going to sleep now. And then we're going to jump into the car. And we're going to go down the way we came. And check out that area. I think it's going to be cool. Alright. Good night lads. Ooh. That's a mine up there. So I think I saw a military base over there. But that might be a Oh shit. 
There we go. Water filled. Yeah, I saw a military base that way, I think, but... Yeah, I don't know. I don't want to get shot, right? And with that, I'm a little bit worried about the military guys that we met in the last episode. So let's go down there and see what we can find. We could go to the factory as well, to be honest. That might be the one that I've seen. Let's see. Yeah, this should take us back to where we were before. Right? Exactly. We have a military zone. We have another mine right there. Well, let's check the buildings right here. And then we're gonna go to the back... Uh, get, and then we're gonna go to the gas station and then the factory. <gasps> Jesus Christ, I didn't see him. Let's see if we can get this guy. If it's only one, we might be able to. It looks like he's chicken underneath the hood. He needs to get that car running. He needs to get out of here. It looks like it's just one guy. I mean, if there's two, I think we should be able to take them down. Our health is pretty okay, so... Let's see. Alright, we got one. I don't think we can loot them, just to answer a question I had before. One of you guys asked me if I was able to loot these military guys. I don't think we are. If they didn't do that in the update. But no, yeah, we can't. That would have been amazing, though. I mean, it would be a pretty easy way to get yourself a, a good gun in the beginning. But I mean, if you're lucky enough, you might be able to find one here. Because I heard a lot of you that actually got an AK and MP5. It was like in the start area. That's crazy. Alright, let's get in here and see what we have. Shotgun ammo. Ooh, imagine if we could get a shotgun right now. A makeshift toilet? Is that how you say it? No, not makeshift toilet. But that's pretty impressive. Oh, he was making food as well. Wish we could take a little bit of that stew with us. All right, here we go. So we got a toolbox. Oh, fertilizer. That's great. Rope and a tire. Some planks, some metal scrap, gas. Ooh, a saw as well? What do we use that for? Do we just take down trees with that? That's interesting. Nothing on the roof. I wish we could grab these solar panels. That would be amazing. <gasps> oh, I wish. I wish. All right, we got everything looted here. Let's put that in the back of our car. We were really lucky that that guy didn't turn around and shoot us right off the bat like they did before. Jesus. All right. Let's put this in. And off to... Well, let's see. The gas station. Oh, we've been to the gas station, haven't we? Some more ammo. 7.62. Some gasoline. All right, let's go to the buildings right here. Oh, look at that. Is that a tiny city or what is that? Let's drive a little bit slow. I don't know what we're going to run up on here. Hopefully no military. Dude, this is crazy cool. Look at that. I love that look. Oh. <gasps> It's a tiny town. No way. This is so cool. So excited. Right, let's see what's in here. Time is almost noon. We should be fine. At the moment, we don't need more tires, but I feel like picking everything that we can up is a good thing. A knife. Let's check the right side, and then we're going to move over on the left side right here, just so we are sure that we pick everything up that we need. Metal scraps. We need a lot of metal scraps before I know that. Ooh, a flashlight. It's way too quiet. I don't like that. Hopefully there's no military dudes around. Oh! MP5! 
45. There we go. What ammo do you use? 45? We don't have nothing of that, of that do we? Ooh, let's check that out. Oh my god, that looks sexy, doesn't it? Oh my god, I'm so happy! We actually found one! Let's see if we can find some ammo for that. Hopefully, we're gonna be able to do that in... I mean, the factory? I don't really know how the loot works here. Let's see. And we're already fully looted. We picked up a lot. We're gonna have to empty a little bit in the car. Alright, we made it to the roof. Oh, come on. Look at that. Sitting down there. Keep the lookout. Oh, this would be a place where you would find a sniper though, wouldn't it? We need to empty ourselves. So we're going to put everything that we have in the car and then we're going to keep on looking. Okay, we, uh, we're we almost full in the car as well. So I don't know if we're going to be able to... To loot everything that we find we might actually have to take i mean right now i would say scraps anything that goes to the car maybe some nails to expand the base and also ammo for the uh, i mean any weapon really uh, but hopefully we get some ammo for the mp5 that would be amazing wait 45 no 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 we have dude that's 45 we had all along <gasps> yes we have ammo already I'm such a dumb. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know guns, you know. <laughs> Jesus. So we had ammo all along. Oh, that's sweet. I'm excited to try this out. Oh, yeah. Something that I should tell you. Something you might see up in the right corner. You can see there's 14 days until the first zombie wave comes along. So this is something with a new update as well. You can actually set what day you want them to arrive on or whatever or if you don't want any waves at all if you just want to play this as a survival game without the, without the waves which i'm i'm really excited about that's that's a good change okay second or well third house and this is the hole we got out with a little bit of ammo some food some alcohol some more pills a lot of cloth and some scrap metal so we're gonna continue here. I don't know if we need a tire. It seems like it's pretty easy to find the uh, find the tire. Uh, it seems like it's pretty easy to find the tires around here. So it's uh, it's it's gonna be fine, I think. We also have a bunch inside the car, or well, back at the base. I f I got a feeling that we have to go back before we go to the factory to uh, to loot. We need to make some more boxes, but for that we need some more nails. Ooh, did we find any nails? I think we found some. So with one nail, I think we can make one box if I remember correctly. Oh, we have a bunch of nails here. Three of them. Right, there we go. Let's check these cars as well. So pretty much what we found in that was uh, some uh, uh, metal scrap. We found some uh, some food and such. Oh shit, rain! Oh no, yeah, we've seen rain before, haven't we? I was like, oh god damn, look at this rain! This is new. It's not new. It's been in before. I don't know if we can get sick by the rain or anything like that. I think we should be safe. The night is coming about, so I think what we should be doing... Let's get back to base. Let's see if we can build... I mean, we do need a roof on our house, so uh, maybe we should be looking into that. At least so we can get the fire going while it's raining, you know? So let's jump into the car, go back to the home, empty ourselves, and then in the morning we can go to the factory. There we go, that's perfect. That went smooth. So what I want to do, I want to put a roof on this, so maybe we need a wall? I don't really know how this is going to work, but I think we need to put a wall up, and then a roof over that, so we can use the fire while it's raining. Um, I mean, we kind of need need it over here. Maybe three or four nails for that, but we also need it. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> we need another box as well, don't we? So I think that's what we're gonna focus on first of all. Let's see what we have. I think we need logs for that. Right, 
right there we go we got another box so what do we need for a wool wood shelter that's what i was thinking about if we could put that on top of this you think i don't think we are able to that's perfect okay it looks the same i can't put it the wrong way can i so what we need now, it's at least a roof over that. So if it starts raining, the fire is protected. That's perfect. Look at that. We even got the, uh, the, 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 oh, never mind. <laughs> I mean, that's good enough. I'm happy with that. Oh, fertilizer. Yeah, I can't wait to grow shit, you know. I think that's going to be amazing. The sun is just on its way up around 6 a.m. That's good to know. How is everything looking? We have enough. I mean, we should have... Yeah, we... Oh, the tires are taking damage. Maybe take some tires. Let's put a tire in and some gas. We should be fine with that. All right. Here we go. Off to the factory. It's going to be interesting. We're gonna go the same way as we did before. I kind of wonder, when you kill the military, are they gonna come back? Ooh, that's close. I guess we're gonna get uh, the answer to that just in a moment here. Oh, sh Is there anything there? I actually think we're fine. All right. be allowed in a car. <laughs> this is a nice little gas station, isn't it? Oh, I like that. What did the sign say? Gasoline motor oil. All right. I don't know if... Ooh, what's that? More ammo? 5.6, I think it was. I don't know if we're actually going to be able to run up on some some other survivors, you know? Hopefully, we're going to be able to meet some nice people. I'm feeling lonely, dude. Oh, it's just around the corner, isn't it? Oh, this might be a big yikes here, guys. Yeah, let's uh, let's uh, let's just park on the road here. I don't know about this. We're going to check this police car, though. Oh! No way we just found a sniper! Wait, 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 wait. 762? We have 762. Wait, we don't have that with us, though, do we? No way! Yes! That actually looks half decent. I like that. Oh... That's so cool. We found an MP5 and also a sniper. That's insane. All right, let's sneak up here. I think there is a mine over there as well. We should check that out. Just to mine some ores. We could do that. We have everything that we need, really. Just need to make a pickaxe. All right, let's see here. Oh, I thought that was military. Okay, so we do have zombies around. Jesus. That's a few of them. Let's see if we can loot these trucks here. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that's three of them. If we can just walk around without getting noticed, that would be great. But yeah, here we go. Come here, bub. <laughs> Was that just one bullet I hit him with? All right, let's try to burst this. Oh, I took the whole head off. That is sick. Oh, I love this weapon. Oh, yeah. 
No, a well-placed headshot, and you're, you're just fine. Oh, that's so sick. Let's see. This is a big-ass truck, isn't it? We gotta be able to find some loot here, no? I mean, we already found an MP5 and a sniper. I called that a win. Let's see if that guy's gonna chase us to the end of the earth. Well, I think we're good with this. Some more nails. That's perfect. Yeah, that's actually something we really do need to expand on the base as soon as possible. And we want to get that roof up so we can put down a furnace. I'm happy we took... <laughs> Look at him running. Look at him go. Here we go. I think that's the guy up on top. Before we go up, we're going to check down here. Ooh, copper ingot. That's perfect. What's that? A vehicle engine. Wait. Oh, yeah. We're going to hold on to that and iron ingot. Ooh, this is a goddamn gold, gold mine, isn't it? Battery. I wonder if we're going to be able to have one more vehicle. It would be awesome to be able to have a pickup. I'm thinking about the space. Just like a vehicle where you can go out and loot and bring home the big hole, you know? All right, we're upstairs. Okay, that's a catwalk. That leads leads over to the next building. All right, let's get over here. I don't think that guy up there is going to be able to grab us. Oh, grab us. <laughs> Do anything to, to us. I think it's stuck up there. Oh, no. Yeah. We might be able to get up here. Let's check this first. Damn, look at all these, this loot. A bucket. We need that. Oh, this is great. Oh, steel pickaxe. Are you kidding me? I said down there this was a gold mine. I mean, I wasn't lying. Damn. It's going to give us a big jump start. There's a lot of stuff that we don't need to craft right now. Thanks to this place. I'm excited. I'm so excited. We're going to go down when we're done up here. Let's see. I think we're going to be able to take that guy down on the roof. I don't know if he's able to get over here, though. Nah, he's stuck. We'll be fine. <laughs> the way they run just cracks me up. All right, let's get down. And I think we should be done in this area. Oh, yeah, obviously we need to check the first floor. Is this another axe as well? Steel axe. Dude, look at the tools we're getting here. Electric cable. I wonder what we're going to be able to do with that. Mm. All right, let's get back to the car. Here we go. Where are we? Trailer park, suburbs, motel. There's a lot of things to check out here, lads. I'm super excited. All right, let's get back to base. Here we go. I mean, it's nothing like we had before, right? Oh, you know what? Let's do this. Grab the sniper. And where do we have that? We should have the ammo maybe in this box. Right here, right? Oh, hell yeah. Eight shots. Ooh, we got a Bambi right there. Let's see. We got it? Oh, dude, this is going to be making hunting so much easier, dude. And don't come at me in chat. Oh, God, Mr. Fisky Poo, that's not how you hunt. You don't shoot the head. You want to shoot the hurt and lung. Don't come at me with that bull crap. <laughs> Next time we're gonna be uh, building everything that we need to make uh, better tools, better weapons, some traps maybe, some nails. And also, if we have time, we're gonna go and check out the military zone. Hopefully that's gonna be something we're gonna be able to do. I kind of want more rifle ammo for that, but we'll see. Before we leave, I before I leave, I want to remind you guys to check out the 20k sub club merch, which is a limited edition. Once again, it's going to be gone forever in a couple of weeks. Now, there is only one more thing for me to say. 
My name is Fizz. Thank you for watching.